the double bass there. I wouldn't have expected that here. Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. So first of all, a Merry Christmas to everyone. It's not Christmas yet, but I'm doing a Christmas special series. And it's the second video today. And I'm reacting to Floor Janssen with Ave Maria. Now, I have done a reaction to Ave Maria before, but sung by Dimash Kudaibergen. And I wanted to do one from Floor as well. And this apparently has been posted last year on the 24th of December, which is Christmas Eve. So it's a pretty fitting song to react to I think now I am a huge Nightwish fan and I have a couple of Nightwish reactions as well so if you want to check those out the links are in the description down below and Floor is my favorite female singer of all time so yeah strap in for this guys now this is the first reaction that I do to one of Floor's own videos I have seen a couple of, of her videos before I started doing reactions but I'm pretty curious to see this one of course the standard is pretty high with me already having heard it from Dimash but she can stand her ground as well so I'm pretty excited to see her do her thing here all right so without any further ado let's check this one out oh by the way the next one tomorrow will be a Christmas medley with Simone Simmons from Epica so stay tuned for that one as well all right, here we go. Ave Maria, Flor Johnson from Nightwish. Here we go. Is it a rock version? I mean, it would fit her. It's definitely already more grandiose, let's say. I'm wondering who did the music instruments. Okay, so, so far it's a totally different version than what I have heard from Dimash. But also I think the version of Dimash is also a lot different than the original as he didn't use any lyrics in the whole song whatsoever and Floor does use the lyrics. I don't know the original very good so I'm not sure uh, how good she stays true to the original herself but I have a feeling there are no distorted guitars in there. <laughs> I don't know who recorded the instruments, uh, were it the musicians of Nightwish themselves, or was it friends of her? I don't know. She has a lot of connections, of course, and I think, isn't it her husband that is the drummer of Sabaton? I don't know. I still have to react to those <laughs> to those as well in the future, but whatever. I don't think the instrumentation is at all like the original, <laughs> let's say, but... I mean, like I expected, very clean voice and very controlled as well. This mic, I have seen that in a couple of thumbnails uh, from her. She has a nice dress there. Very fitting for Christmas as well, I think. Okay, let's return a little. Here we go. Such a beautiful voice as well. Oh, 
Shield still keeps going. Long note as well here. Uh, can you imagine how it would sound without the guitar and the drums? That would sound a lot more classical, I think, than it does now. But just because of the drum and the guitar, it just gives a totally different feel than what you would expect from this song. Also, it's pretty clear here that it's pre-recorded and then they filmed it afterwards. Not because of you notice it, but because there are different shots from filming her and, I mean, most of the times it's done like that, so... She's also classically trained, of course, so it's pretty clear to see that. The double bass there, I wouldn't have expected that here. Man, she has an um, she has an incredibly big mouth. She can open she can open her mouth so widely. Like no wonder she has big sound from her voice there. My God, but didn't expect the double bass drum to kick in there. A little bit more of a belt here. That's interesting. I have seen Floor sing a couple of times where she, like there are different ways to vibrate your, your voice. But a couple of times I see with her that she literally uses her jaw to vibrate or to make a vibration there. I mean, she, she she's able to use different methods, of course, but I've seen that a couple of times uh, with her already. For example, the one that she's done with Hank Port, uh, the Phantom of the Opera. There it's pretty clear that she uses that technique for the vibration as well. Yeah. Okay. Floor. Yes. Now, I'm pretty sure that she didn't use the whole range that she has because, like, hearing from the Nightwish songs that she's sung over the years, she can go so high and lower as well. <laughs> Um, so, I don't think it was her intention to show off her whole range, of course. That's not what she wanted to do in this one. But it's a totally different version, I assume, than the original. And from the one from Dimash, for that matter. What I do know is that from uh, Dimash's version, he goes higher. Like, she goes 
Ave Maria. And he does Ave Maria. So there's a different in tone that Dimash does uh, in comparison to the original. Because I think that's where Floor does keep true to the original. From what I've heard, at least. So yeah. Guys, this is the first time that I reacted to one of Floor's videos. So if you want me to check more of Floor's videos, then definitely let me know in the comment section below. And give me some suggestions. Tomorrow will be time for a good friend of hers, Simone Simmons from Epica. And it's been a while since I've done one from Epica as well. And I actually wanted to do Consigned to the Oblivion, I think it's called. But that will be one for a future video because I wanted to do something related more to Christmas. And there are not too many Christmas related videos from Epica as far as I have seen. Uh, at least but I see that there is a Christmas medley from her so that will be up tomorrow guys I hope you enjoyed my reaction to this one don't forget to subscribe like and share the video also don't forget to check out all my Nightwish reactions the links will be in the description down below I also have other reaction videos I have music videos and tutorials for you guys to check out so thank you very much and see you guys next time bye <laughs>